John Singleton Mosby was born in Powhatan County, Virginia in 1833. He attended Hampton Sydney College in 1847, which is in Virginia. In 1854, John Mosby brought a gun to his school and shot his bully. Uh, he went to jail for one year and in 1861 he came back and ironically he joined the law and became a lawyer. Two years after the Civil War started on June 3, 1863, John Mosby formed the famous Mosby's Rangers or the 43rd Battalion Cavalry. On midnight, March 8, 1863, John Mosby led his raiders undetected by Union lines in the Fairfax County Courthouse. He captured General Stoughton, two captains, 30 enlisted men, and 58 horses. This helped the Confederacy in future wars. This was a big accomplishment in his career and was known as the Mosby's Midnight Raid. After General Stoughton was captured by John Mosby, it weakened the Union. It was also rumored that John Mosby almost captured Ulysses Grant on his train. Three weeks after Robert E. Lee's surrender to Ulysses Grant, John Mosby got his parole and disbanded Mosby's Rangers. One year after the Civil War and after gaining his parole, John Mosby and his family were often harassed by Union forces in the South for unreasonable charges. Later in January 1866, John Mosby met with Ulysses Grant to get a handwritten document of safe conduct from Union forces. Later in 1878, John Mosby became the U.S. Consul of Hong Kong for the federal government, but later became a U.S. public speaker. He later died on May 30th, 1916 in Washington, D.C. He will be remembered as the Grey Ghost of the American Confederate Army.